Hey guys, it's Mad Dog, and today's another flip video. So, I mean, these are just some of my flips that I've been doing. I'm also, I have decided to do my videos like this one from now on, where I pause it and let the flips go through. I don't know actually how long, you know, all this was. I think it was about 30 minutes. And I ended up making, um, I think 900k, 800k, something like that. But... You know, after all the recent giveaways and everything, I do need to start flipping again, like, you know, like I used to, and make some actual profit. I'm down to, I think, 38 mil, uh, so hopefully that's going to be, you know, skyrocketing from this point forward. I'm focusing on room crafting a lot. It's a lot of fun. Well, I mean, as fun as a, you know, a skill like that could be. But I do have fun with it, and you know I make some money there. Uh, it's really it's not a bad money maker for anyone you know that does have a room crafting level and does want you know to make some money without flipping. So for me that's just a little bit extra on the side. I, <clears throat> you know, with a 38 mil cash stack, you know, there are items where you know I don't have my list of items like I used to. So I'm going through and, you know, finding stuff that works for me. And that's basically what you need to do when you are flipping. You need to find what works for you. And uh, we had a discussion in the French chat the other day, you know, how much is a good profit. Guys, the simple answer to that, if you like the profit that you're getting, then do it. That's all that really matters. Uh, you know, you don't have to come into French chat and ask us, you know, is 100k a flip good or 200k a flip good? If you think it's good, then it's good. That's all that really matters. So for me, I mean, I do incorporate some smaller flips into mine, and uh, and then I do look out for the bigger ones. But you're not always gonna find, you know, a huge margin and make a ton off of the items you're flipping. I think I flip, yeah, Carol's right here. The thing with Barrows, guys, I don't suggest it yet. Like, I continuously test it. So as soon as it is, you know, back up and running good, I'll let you guys know. But there are a few things about it right now that just, it's not all that great. <clears throat> if you can't afford to lose money, don't do Barrows. Because their fluctuation is ridiculous. Like you can lose just as much as you can make you know I mean, price is just going back and forth and you have to know what items to do like you know you have to look at the charge and figure out what barrows is going good right now so I don't suggest barrows yet but as soon as it's good I will let you guys know I'm doing a little bit of barrows uh, here and there but like I said you know, prices will drop on you, and you can lose money. So, if you can't afford to lose money, go ahead and try it. See what you think about it. But, you know, if you're one of the people that, if you lose money, it just, you know, devastates you, don't do barrows yet. Um, what else? So, I've decided, you know, with all these videos coming out and everything, I really have, you know, a passion for this kind of stuff. And I've created a real life channel. You can find that on my channel. You can go ahead and uh, subscribe to it if you want. If you're into you know that kind of stuff, I'm gonna be doing uh, vlogs quite a bit because I don't know. It's just fun to do. I do like that kind of stuff. So I'll be updating that, you know, uh, just every now and then with a video, of, you know, real life, so you guys uh, can see what I'm doing. If you're interested, the uh. The channel is up now. I don't have any videos on it, but you can go subscribe to it if you want. And as soon as you know a video does come up, you'll know. Uh, what else? What else? Let's see, my girlfriend. I think I've actually talked her into playing. She, uh, we're gonna make her an account tonight, so might make that into a video. So that'll be up, you know, tonight or tomorrow, if she does end up making an account. I think it's pretty cool if I can get her to start playing. But <clears throat> French chat's going awesome. 
I don't know if I showed it in this video, but tons of people in it all the time. Uh, our Ventrilo server is awesome. There, you know, there's usually about eight, ten people in there. We all talk and have a good time. If you are interested in Ventrilo, go ahead and download it. All of this information is on my blog. It's all safe. Um, but go to my blog, and right now I think it's the first post. It's got the download link and my server information on it. So you can come in and talk to us, talk to me personally if you want. You know, I'm, if I'm on, I am in vent. Um, the IRC channel, I don't know, I haven't really been paying a lot of attention to it. I am in there every now and then, but it doesn't seem like it's going to kick off. If you guys do use IRC, go ahead and join. Uh, you know, why not? If you don't, you know, my friend's chat's open, so come on in. I love seeing new people in there. And I'm sorry to everyone if I don't reply. You know, with this channel and everything, I'm really busy. And a lot of the times, you know, I'm on another screen or something like that, so I don't always see what you say. I do try to reply when I do see it, though. Uh, what else? Check my blog, The Daily Giveaways, 200k. Oh, okay. I've been thinking, or I had this idea last night, actually. I want to do a 2 mil weekly hide-and-seek event. And what I'm thinking, guys, is... You know, every week at a certain time, certain day. I want it to be the same day and time, so I have to figure out, you know, with my schedule what I can do. <clears throat> but I'd like to do two games of hide and seek every week and give away one meal for each of them. So if you guys are interested in that, I mean, let me know. I really need feedback on this stuff, guys. Uh, so drop a comment down below. Let me know what you think about that. Let me know if you're interested in the real life channel, too. Because. It really doesn't matter. The real life channel is going to be something, you know, I do for me, you know, rather than for you guys. But if you are interested in, you know, what I'm doing, go ahead. Channel's there. Subscribe. Um, what else? I tried quite a few items in this video. Some of them, the margins just don't seem to be what they used to be. Or, I mean, maybe it's just, you know, where I am still adjusting to a new cash stack. I'm trying to figure everything out. Or, I mean, I might be used to, or used, used? I might be used to the bigger margins. So, I don't know. But I am making, you know, quite a bit of profit here. Uh, 99 rune crafting. I am still working on it. Very slow. I forgot how slow, guys. Oh, gosh. I think I've gained one level. I'm level 84 now. So as soon as I get, you know, maybe one couple more levels, I'll upload a video about runecrafting. I've had a lot of people ask me for runecrafting guides, too. So, again, drop a comment below and let me know what you think. You know, if you're interested in that, I might do it for you guys. It's, uh, I mean, my runescape channel is, you know, for you guys, the viewers. So let me know what you want to see. Um, what else do I have to say to you guys? Again, don't come in French chat and ask for items. It, uh, we've seen quite a bit of improvement lately. Like, we don't, we're not just constantly spammed with people coming in and asking for items. So that's great. I get a lot of PMs about people telling me, you know, I helped you so much. That's awesome, guys. I'm glad that you're getting, you know, use out of these videos. It really means a lot to me, knowing that, you know, they are helping you. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to like, favorite, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.